This is the first ever color picture from a world more than 54 million kilometers beyond ours. It's one of several sent from Perseverance's array of cameras. This one shows the rover being lowered down by cables to its Martian landing spot from the delivery space vehicle. NASA scientists say the rover came through its action-packed landing Thursday in fine form. I'm happy to say that the rover is doing great and is healthy on the surface of Mars and continues to be highly, highly functional and um, awesome and just, I'm exhilarated. This shot shows one of the rover's heavy-duty wheels that it will use to explore the red dust of Jezero Crater for signs of extinct ancient life. But Perseverance won't be making tracks right away. First, engineers will perform system checks, update its software, and test some of its instruments, like a robotic arm and a microphone. In a month or so, Ingenuity, the drone attached to the rover, will take its first flight. This rover is an epic effort. It represents um, eight years of hundreds of engineers at the laboratory, thousands around the world, a total of over 4,000 human years of investment. And already a detail in this picture has caught scientists' attention. That rock on the left, the one that looks like a hunk of Swiss cheese. And there are a number of different geological processes that can make holes in a rock like that. And so the science team is now thinking about what this might mean. And one of the questions we'll ask first is whether these rocks represent a volcanic or sedimentary origin. And both of those would be equally exciting to the teams. Ultimately, Perseverance may dig up evidence that life existed on Mars at some point in the ancient past. That could be a sign that life is widespread in our solar system our galaxy, and the far-flung reaches of the universe, and that we are not alone. Rob Reynolds, Al Jazeera, Los Angeles.